All right, it's a little loud right now, but I forgot to do a intro. This is episode, I don't know, seven. It's with two of the people I've worked with in the past with their stutter. And uh, yeah, it's a really open, vulnerable conversation. You're gonna fucking love it. And we start off with eye ga- with eye with eye gazing. So we each stare at each other for one minute. Um, and yeah, and I think the eye gazing is a great way to for you to kind of see into our comfortability with each other. If we're comfortable, if we're not, if we're seeking uh, if we're seeking approval, if like the, the eyes show so much. So enjoy and the eye gazing will be a common thing I do with guests so enjoy all right no talking no breaking eye contact for one minute And good. Beautiful. That uh, felt really natural. Really? Yeah. Yes. How about you? Yeah, very. You're you're very right about how na about how na about how natural it is. Like your some people's eyes, it makes you like feel like I want to look uh, away from them. Like there's something aggressive about it or something. Yeah. That 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 that's something that draws you in here. Yeah. Three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yeah. man. I feel, I feel like I broke some trust there. <laughs> nice. No, it's fine. Nice. <laughs> I'm not going to do that again. Welcome to, this would be episode seven, I believe, of Forbidden Authenticity Within. 
This is the first guest podcast we're doing. I'm doing. We're doing. And this podcast is different than most podcasts in a way where it's not so much about content or about the ideas that people share, but it's primar- primarily focused uh, upon um, why people share what they share. So why I share what I share, why these guests will share what they share, um, and to uh, and to examine the in the interpersonal dynamics between us all as 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 vulnerably as possible in the moment just to like strip back what ah uh, what authentic conversation looks like and to leave no place for hiding so that's my little introduction i'm sure it's going to get going to get be- going to get better over time but i will just let you guys introduce yourselves I'll leave it at that, and then let's see what comes out. Well, I can uh, start here. Uh, my name is uh, my name is Nabila, and I've been um, I've been uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I've been in contact with the is here for almost now two and a half years maybe uh, and today I am here and I am happy to be here to m- meet you like in p- person and also you Leo yeah this is me that's not you yeah my, my name is Leo I'm uh, from Finland and I also met Chase around the same time as N- Nabila uh, two and a half years ago and uh, I have been stuttering since I was four years old when I learned to speak and it has um, it, it, it has affected me in a way that I haven't been so I haven't been able to be so authentic and throughout the years I'm learning to become more and more authentic and of course we did that with today's when I was in his program. That's my introduction. Nice. And I, nice, Leo. I just want to say, like, to to you guys too, that there's no rules to this. Like, you guys can talk. Like, there's there's not you like you don't have to wait for me to say something. This yeah, is just, just like talk. conversation. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, when you talk now about uh, what this podcast is about, it's about uh, sh- sharing. Mm. And it's so cool, so fucking cool, because I've had it in my head now for for a period of time. Um, and, and the thought is, um, the thought is, uh, why do I need to feel the, the need to sh- share stuff? Like, to share my th- thoughts or my opinions or even why do I need to share stuff on Instagram mm. or is it because is it because I feel that I need to sp- uh, is it because I feel the, the, the need that I need to sp- to sp- to sp- to sp- to, sp- to, sp- to, sp- to sp- to spread n- 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 knowledge, or is it because I feel the need to make people n- n- notice me? What do you think? <laughs> well, <laughs> or you, Leo? I I would actually like to make a comment on the process of you sharing this, 
not on the actual thing. We yes. we can come back to this. Yes, of course. Um, that's cool with you. Mm. Do you have something to say about? Well, of course, I am. What she's actually saying. No, I'm studying too much, so maybe you don't understand what I'm saying. Uh, no, no, no. So <laughs> I, I, I think more will come out when I, when I say this. Mm -hmm. So first, um, just for everyone watching, is the way you're s stuttering right now. Is this more than usual? It's more, more than usual. Mm -hmm. A lot more. Okay. So like, yes. my question is, why? I'll just say it bluntly. Like, why are you not get? Why are you not giving yourself the time, to? Because what I see is a lot of, like, you start the sentence and now there's like the goal to finish it, yeah. and I see there's no time you're giving yourself in between to like, <sighs> like take as long as it needs. To, yes. to take that's that's what I feel it is th that way as you feel and oh, so yeah uh, 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 I have the same kind of feelings but it depends on the situation mm. it depends uh, if I if I want to look a certain way or or if I am um, want to look for, for validation mm. From people. Mm. Mm hmm. And I, I just want to say to anyone, to 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 anyone watching, what 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 I said might sound like harsh to a, a lot of people, um, but I just, I just want to see what comes out. I don't think you are harsh at, at all. Okay. I'm not even shedding an ounce of a tear. Okay. Like I don't take it. I, I don't take this in any way. Nice. Like it's like as something hard or you know. I just I'm just I'm just a p p uh, I'm just a p p <laughs> I'm just a p appreciating you t t t telling me that. Nice. Yes. So, what comes up for what com what comes up for you when I when I say. Because this is what it feels like to me. Like, why are you not giving yourself the time? Like, I've had many, in, many interactions in my life where I I push through so much shit. Mm. But as, as this dynamic right now, mm. I I really don't feel that I'm gonna push through and push through push through anything. No. But if I was in a different dynamic, I can definitely see myself pushing, and I still do from time to time. You do. So this is my question, like we all face this, but why right now in this moment do you, do you feel like you don't have the time to just be yourself? I need to, I need to go b b back a little bit. It's because I've had actually now a period of time where I started a lot more. And like we go back maybe two weeks or ish and when uh, and 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 when i am at that kind of time when i stutter it f feels like it feels like i'm not a able to stop myself it just is you know mm -hmm. and and at th 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 this moment it's because of it's because of that uh, it's because of that i am in that p p period of time mm -hmm. and also because i think i don't b b believe that i can just s s uh, snap out of it mm. you know mm. so i do believe that it's it's i do believe that i am stuck in my head Mm. of course so and I feel maybe and I also feel that I am k kind of t tired of having it uh, in my head that I need to think how I speak 
how I how I how I breathe in and out. I'm tired of it. You, you know, I'm I, I just just want to be able to stutter and feel good anyway. Do you understand me? I understand, but again, this may sound harsh. No, nothing is harsh for me. I've been through okay. a lot. <laughs> okay, but I feel like. At the beginning, when you started to when you when you when you started to answer, I, I really felt you in that answer, and then as you continued talking about, I touch it. It's like you you said something that sounded good, like that would sound good. But when, when you when you when you started to talk about, um, like you're so tired of, of it. Um, when when you went into that ten, when you went into that tangent, it felt like it felt like I kind of lost you there in a second, mm. and I felt like I I don't really know, but it. I, I think I understand what you're th thinking of because because it was a m m moment here where I like he he hesitated, and maybe. I just lied to myself, maybe. Mm. Do you understand? Yeah. Mm. Maybe. Yeah. It's uh, it. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna <laughs> get your opinions on it, this Leo. But it's very interesting because um, for anyone watching, and I don't mean to just keep saying it for anyone watching that kind of takes us out of this this space, but um. Just as a ground, uh, just as a grounding factor, I I want to say as a general rule that is, I feel true most of the time, when we are being our most authentic selves, we don't stutter. Like in a room by ourselves, we have all that time and space, and no pressure, no external pressure to sound a certain way or to say a certain thing, to get a certain reaction or to feel a certain way from the other person. And that re that no added pressure and the time to just say whatever we want as long as it takes, there's no tension there that causes the stutter and we're, mo we're our most authentic selves there. So with myself, when I hear myself and feel myself start stuttering a lot and pushing all and put and, and pushing all and pushing a lot, like what you said, Leo, I, uh, the, one of the first thoughts in my head is like, what am I trying to get from this in get from this interaction right now? Like what am I maybe even get? But what am I trying to con? What am I trying to control in this in 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 this in in this in in this interaction? And oftentimes, I'm trying to control how another person is seeing me. I'm trying to control how another person feels about me. I'm trying to control how I'm being per how I'm being perceived and uh, avoiding a lot of things, and that causes me to be in my head and feel more inauthentic in that moment that's so true everything you told them now t t told us uh, uh, us i actually do believe that if we are like you said like really really authentic we don't stutter yes because mm -hmm. we don't start stutter when we are in a room without anybody there i i think a cool experiment because it's it's fucking crazy like stuttering is like such a in such a in such an interesting thing and i've had this thought a lot when i'm in a, a conversation i feel myself stuttering a lot and pushing uh and pushing uh pushing all pushing, pushing a lot in to think like I can just close the door, go into the go into the bathroom, and talk completely fine. 
<laughs> like that's fucking crazy. It's fucking crazy how, how how you can go from that to closing a door to speaking completely fine. So I think a cool thought experiment to do right now would be like like what's so different about right now besides the camera and I us, know the difference. But like what's the difference between you being like I'm a, alone. A, I'm a, a, I'm a door. real. I'm like, authentic. I'm it's like nobody there to who's like looking at me. But it's we we want mm -hmm. you to be the version you are in a room by yourself. Yes, and I am a very cool person when I'm all by myself too. You're cool now. <laughs> yes. But it's it's crazy because we want that version. You want to be that version. Mm. Why, like? Why can't I just allow myself? And actually, now when you took this up, when <coughs> I go back, I told you that I started to start now a little bit more, no, a lot bit more, when I started my internship. Okay. Mm. So my so my internship is all about me being it's all about me being touched okay so the school and the hospital everybody is looking at me how I am speaking with the patients how I handle stuff and blah blah so it's all about them <laughs> judging me of course it's what, what do you I'm mean back. It's, all, it's all about them judging you uh, because if I don't do the things I supposed to do I won't pass mm -hmm. the ex exam it's, it's like an ex exam but in like uh, um, but it's like uh, physical you know, so I need to speak good. I need to be good, you know, blah, 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 to pass. So, of course, I went back from, like, I had a time mm. there. I didn't stutter almost, like, maybe <sighs> just a little bit. And it, it was like, uh, it was like other people's stutter, like, it's 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 not even stuttering. It just uh, it it's it's uh, it's when you st tumble, mm. you know. Mm. So mm. I it was so it was, yeah. You understand. Yeah, you you're gonna say it was so good. It was so good. Yeah, um, <laughs> I actually feel that because now that I started to think about my internship. I just finished my internship in the Netherlands in the okay, yeah. for six months, and I found out uh, and I found out this interesting thing, thing that it, 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 in the starting when I went to the internship, I felt like I was stuttering more in the starting, but then in the middle of the internship, I wasn't stuttering that much. No, that's good. And then again, when I was leaving the internship, internship. I, I was stuttering a lot again mm. and now when you were talking about um, being judged I think when I went to the workplace I felt like the new person in there and everyone could judge me and and I was like the center of the attention and then the same thing happened when I was leaving because they gave me gifts they uh, write like a nice report about um, about my internship to me and I'm the center of attention again mm. but, but then in the middle of my internship I, I was just working in there I wasn't a, I was just an employee you know? yes mm. <laughs> see mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> and it was because of that actually I, I'm sorry now I interrupted you here Def. how dare you how dare I you but cast because out. you know when I t t t told you now I'm tired of being like I need to speak 
good not to stutter blah 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 i w want to be able like like when i had a time where i didn't stutter at all i was good i was like oh thank you blah 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 and now the time is here where i stutter like this and i don't i don't want to hate my <clears throat> I don't want to hate myself because I am here. You understand? Mm -hmm. So I want to be able to like, okay, I am, I am okay in this way and in that way too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't even like if you have a starter or like you you you, you, just, you do I, I don't care like mm. I I don't care why do I care about <coughs> I d I don't w want to care about me d d d d d doing it you know yeah what's the, what's the what's the difference between seeing us stutter and being like yeah that doesn't matter and then but when you when you stutter it's not even when you stutter but when when you're in that state where the train's going yeah and, the state. and you and you can't take a second in like you can't feel yourself really it feels like yourself is somewhere stuck in there and you're in d and you're in d and you're in defense kind of like this person who's just speaking and trying to sound good and trying to be right and trying to do the right things. Um, yeah, trying to do, 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 do. Trying, do. Yeah, just trying. Just trying, yeah. Trying. Um, but what's the difference between, because when we stutter, when we get caught in those blocks, it's us trying, it's us doing that. But you're still like, you're still cool with it, but not with yourself. Of course, there's the difference if it's us and it's you, but like, why what do you feel stops you from seeing yourself in us or us in yourself <clears throat> yeah I, I i yeah i have the answer of course i don't want to t take it out maybe it's kind of hard but i know the answer and the answer is go back that Mm. I can't believe or understand how a person can be with me in this way I am and if I am this person when I, when I can't get the words out and blah 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 I won't be lovable. Mm -hmm. Yes, and if I'm and if I can be l l lovable, I'm gonna be all by myself. Mm. But but here, of course, I understand and I n know that that it's that it's not a fact because I have started a, a lot with people and still I have people here yeah I, I, was, I have something quickly to add there mm -hmm. um, this guy named named er named Irvin 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 Yalom Irvin Yalom I've read his book too you read the book yes which which one uh in Swedish, therapins uh, It means in English, the gift of therapy. Oh, nice! Something yeah. like that. Yeah. I, I just read that book, um, but in I actually have his big book right here. In the book, um, the theory and practice of group. A group, a, oh, that I haven't a read. group. No, I, I bet you wouldn't. It's like 
not because of anything about I you. Will. <laughs> but it's like I will. it's like not the av- not the average person reads that. He he states. So you t- t- tell me I'm not I'm just an average p- person. Thank you, Chase. Not the <laughs> average person. <laughs> just that. kidding. Not the average person. Yeah, that means you're average. <laughs> um. He has this quote where he says. Give me a sec. Actually, I I need to find exactly. It's gonna be two seconds. No stress. You take your time. Oh, I can take my time? Yeah. Oh, I thank you. You can also take your time. You can yeah. take your time. We can all take our time. Yes, thank you, Liu. <coughs> thank you. Um, it's going to be right here. I took notes on the book, like a lot of pages. Because the book's fucking amazing. And he says... Group therapy thoughts. No? How is the book named again? He says something like uh, group therapy. therapy uh, something All like right. That. It says research su- research supports this 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 thesis by by demonstrating that one's interpersonal be- interpersonal beliefs express themselves in be in behaviors that have a predictable and restrictive interpersonal impact on others. The interpersonal defense is the problem, not the, not this, not the solution. So what this means is that like, say I have a interpersonal. So with other people, I, I have this bill. I have this bill. I have this belief that I'll get shot. I'll get shot. I'll get shot out. When I'm in a group conversation, p p p people will 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 talk over me. He says that um, <coughs> these interpersonal beliefs express themselves in b in b in behaviors. So there's something that I that I will do that have a predictable and restrictive interpersonal impact on others. So the response that I give from having this be from have from having this belief have a pre a pre a predictable and restrictive response um interpersonal response so basically if I have the but if I have the belief that p that people will shut me out then I having that belief I will express behaviors that are uh, that are uh, that are that are aligned with that be- that are aligned with that belief. So I will talk a bit. I'll talk a bit more quiet. I won't stand be. I won't stand behind my words. I'll kind of back out of. I'll kind of back out of sentences. And that thought rest- restricts people from actually taking on my words. Like my behaviors because of this be- be- because of this belief restricts people from fully allowing me to be in the con in in the in the conversation the belief that you have <laughs> that you being in this state of you stu- of you stuttering mm-hmm. quite a bit of this stu- of this stuttering state this belief that you have will express itself in your be in your be in your behaviors and the things you do the behaviors you have in this bill in this bu- in this belief system restricts people from actually loving you yes because you'll act in ways that you don't show your true self yes. and you'll act in ways that you'll think you're not or you're not worthy or your words aren't worthy or you you won't fully love what you're saying and it goes back to the common thing like you have to learn to love yourself first before you can let anyone love you and do believe that and that belief it reinforces itself because it's like if you think that you won't be loved with this state but because this be- because this belief you have you act in a way that doesn't uh, that doesn't allow people to love you this belief just keeps on growing and growing and growing and the thing is 
the thing is um, the thing is that I have been I, I have been working with my beliefs okay for like five years maybe more more and yes and then I I come to a time where I actually do do where 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 I actually do love myself and the person I am is that when you're fluent no even mm. at times when I stutter a little bit, okay. Uh, for me, when I, when I still like, I have t t times where I, where I think I am good as I, as as I am, okay. But the times I do <laughs> love myself, it comes out in a way that I don't even <laughs> I don't even uh, need to stutter or I don't stutter because I come to a place where I <laughs> value myself and then uh, I think because everything is like Everything is like um, everything is like uh, is like routines, okay? Is which uh, routine? Um, uh, routine in English, you know oh, what routine is? Routine. Yes, routine. and I think <coughs> we go back to our. our, our um, I, I think we go back to our. All beliefs, uh, s sometimes, mm. to I don't know how to explain it actually in I English. I f fucked up now. I I don't even I I don't even I don't even <laughs> remember what um, what I was going to t t t t t tell you. I don't perfect. <laughs> Perfect. I think it's like uh, because uh, I have those times also when I feel like that I love myself and I feel good, but I think it comes somewhere from outside. But then when I'm alone, I start to get those subconscious um, like feelings and thoughts which come up and and that. They, they cannot be so good all this so. yeah yes I, I just want to say one thing yeah when you were like I forgot what I was going to say I think this is important that like I believe that like we that the importance of when you speak is not even 10% of actually what you say. So, no. th so the fact that you forgot it. It wasn't even important. But it, it's, it's, it's all of what we feel of when you're speaking. Yes. And I, I, I could tell yeah. there was like, I need to make this sound good. I, I need to make sense. And then when it got to the end of it, where it didn't sound good to you and it didn't make sense because you forgot it. It's like oh, I fucked up when in reality I needed to sound good. I needed to yes. To when in reality good. the fucked up was the whole stress of trying to make it sound good because it doesn't matter what the fuck you say. It's all in like where it comes from, like what we feel when you're talking. That's all mm -hmm. that matters. You can say fucking gibberish, but if it feels good, we feel good, and that's and if it's real then that's what allows us to connect. I need to prove myself, yes. I've felt it so badly now. I've I really felt it. Mm. I felt it. I needed to prove myself that I'm smart, I'm good, I can, blah, 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 bullshit. What I would like to ask now is Leo, because this is the first day, 
first time I ever met Julia, and um, there's something that I saw that I see inside myself when I'm pushing through blocks or pushing through stutters or stuttering a lot that I feel is definitely true for you. But first, I'm just going to ask you a question. And I, th I think I know the answer, but because um, I think you talked about it. But um, in conversations, does it feel like people, when you're in a stuttering state, at least, does it feel like people tend to um, like avoid eye contact with you or feel or get uncomfortable like is that a common thing so much so much sometimes but it depends if i give the eye contact it depends also mm. and it's usually if i'm able to keep the eye contact even if i'm stuttering they, they also keep it but they, there are still some instances where, where I'm looking at the other person and if I'm taking a long time mm. they may look away mm. yeah we, uh, yeah because what what I saw that I've noticed in, my, in myself that's a really cool thought is like alright I'll, I'll just say it with, with myself first that when I have caught myself in the past pushing to blocks I or I or let, let's just say I know that a s that a stutter is coming. I I turn into a version of myself, or not always, but sometimes when I when I when I'm in a stut when I'm in a stuttering state, I turn into a version of myself that um, feels like always the the out the out the outcome is the person doesn't really like me or gets on or gets on or gets on or gets uncomfortable or doesn't laugh if, if it was supposed to be a joke hmm. and it's just like the the vibe is just always off hmm. I feel it feels like that and one thing I noticed which it which I don't feel now but when when we first met it feels like it feels like um the, I felt your eye contact like you didn't you didn't break it on any blocks I don't think. But I I could feel you. Like. Being in your head and. Basically trying to trying to say the word, like I and try not to break the eye contact. Yeah. Like I I felt the in the the intention you had to not break the eye contact and that's like when when we first met and i felt like there was a breakage of any put at of any put of any put of any potential vibe with that so so you mean that i came off like a inauthentic uh, and that 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 made you not want to connect with me yeah. I'll 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 say it like this I'll say it like when when I feel a stutter is coming not always but some sometimes I the reason why I feel pe why the people don't respond in a way that I thought they would have they don't laugh at the joke or they don't um like they're just there's just a weird reaction it's not because I stuttered it's not because of that but it's because the vibe went from this this all this all this open vibe of like friendly vibe this play this 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 this, this playful vibe to uh, I completely betrayed that vibe that was already going on to go in my head and try to say the word right mm. and to try to not break the eye contact mm. like I 
I was no longer feed. I was no longer feed. I was no longer feeding that vibe, and that feels fucking weird to somebody hmm. when they feel like, oh, he's 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 being he's being playful, and he's being nice. He's being he's he's being charming, and then all of a sudden, I just see him staring at me, and I like, <laughs> and then I fucking lose him. Like it feels like I, I don't feel him, and uh. I don't feel I don't feel him, and I I real realize that in myself like things are going well with someone that I'm talking to like it's playful it's fun and then I just see them get fucking see I see them get ser- I see them get serious and it's because they're like they're con- they're con- they're confused they're not confused cuz I stuttered they're confused because I gave up that vibe that was going on and now what I do is like in- instead of think or at least I try to do instead of thinking like how can I say this word right? Or how can I, even what I've taught in the past of like, how can I make this sound as smooth as possible? Like that's still a different vibe. That's still being in your head. Like how can I stutter as smooth as possible? I try not to do that anymore. And I try to say like, okay, what's the vibe that I want to main, that I want to main, that I want to maintain. Hmm. And if it's, and if it's, and if it's, and if it's playfulness, I like feel that, I feel that playfulness vibe that I'm feeling right now. And I'm like, how can I maintain that even with a stutter? And that's what's in, that's, that's, that's what's in my head. And then I see the reaction if I stutter or not is like, it's the same because the, the, the vibe, I, my, and my, and my energy didn't change. Yeah. And I, I, the reason why I brought that up is because I felt like when you're in blocks, I felt your en- I felt your energy change quite, yeah. quite a bit. In what way? In that like, it got serious and like you were on a mission to hold, <laughs> to hold, to hold, to hold, to hold eye, to hold eye contact and uh-huh. to um, say the word. Like it was, that was your goal instead of maintaining or creating any type of vibe. And yeah, does that make sense at all? Yeah, but that makes sense. But I don't really think about it. Like I just try to speak. You know, so mm. <laughs> it's some unconscious thing happening. Yeah. No. No. It's very un. It's very unconscious, and I don't feel it now. <laughs> like you hold eye contact when you stutter and whatever. It feels. It feels like I'm still with you. Yeah. But when we first met, it felt like you're gone. Like you're you're in your own head completely. Yeah, but I feel that every time that I meet new people, I feel that. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. No. I feel really, really like like I told you that I was feeling anxious to come to meet you, and I was feeling like. Ne- nervous and everything yeah no, so, yeah. so of course it comes up like a like a uh, threat, threat I'm not there because I was trying to be something else that I'm not yeah <laughs> one 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 hundred one hundred percent but I, w- I would think this even extends to past the first meet past the first meeting because I I know it does for for me like if there's some like for a for example um, I worked at a golf course last summer I told you mm. and there was like some girls that were working at the uh, <coughs> at the golf shack basically that I I would see like once a day and um there was sometimes i would talk to them and i felt a stutter coming up and i i realized like what i was going to say was s- supposed to be funny but it came off serious and it came off like they looked at me like the fuck <laughs> like that wasn't funny at all and i was like it's not because i stuttered it's because i got so like i i got so like i have to make mm, I sat, I sat, I sac, I sacrificed the vibe of kin of continuing to feed the vibe for trying to have some type of safety of like being fluent or um, 
sounding funny or not even sounding funny but uh, yeah the reason why I, I bring this up is because i saw it in the eye contact that like that it seemed very clear that the importance of holding eye contact while you stutter was valued over like maintaining or creating any type of vibe and i think when we get in that relationship it's very hard for somebody to feel comfortable and safe yeah because there's no consistency there's like a constant changing of like of yeah. your goal yeah and i had a thought of like i feel like i need to tell you this because it's a fucking like I don't see how anyone else would ever tell you this in your life. Like yeah. it's it's an uncomfortable conversation. But um I fucking wish somebody would have told me, told me that before, but it's something I see inside of myself that I realize when and I when when I worked on like fuck it if I break eye contact if it doesn't matter as long as I I feel like I'm still feeding the vibe that is always like congruent that like that feels real and yeah. when i feel like my life and my stuttering has gotten 10 times better and the depth of what i can create with somebody is so much deeper now because um i i don't care so much about um stuttering as much as i care about just like being the same version of myself if i stutter or not like maintaining that vibe maintaining how who i want to be so how do you how do you exactly then like practice that yeah <laughs> yeah I, 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 it's yeah i think i thought this same thing i was like god damn it we have to think about a lot of stuff. No, no, no. How it's, we breathe. How it's we don't not breathe. like that. It's not <laughs> yeah, like that. It's of course, it's not. not. It's, yeah, it's, it's not. But yeah, it, but in else. my head, or, or and maybe the people who are watching this is like, God damn it! We have to breathe. We have to speak, like, we have to speak very slowly. We have to do this and this. Mm. How am I able to achieve it? Yeah. If I need to th think about everything. Yeah. Yeah. How and do you do? What I would say, I've, I'm, I'm not perfect on this either, but what I've learned is that's still recording. It is still recording. What I've learned is like the 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 more, of course, we all know this, but the more we think, yeah. the more we get in our head, the more we're gonna stutter. And the vibe thing is not a thinking thing. It's not like, how how should I maintain this vibe? It's a complete feeling thing. It's, a, it's about being, co being, con being connected to what's in between us right now. Like, it's hard to even fucking say, but like there's some vibe in between us right now or maybe there's some vibe I want to make in between us right now. Let's say you're a cute girl and we're on a first date. There's, there, there, <laughs> Hi, cutie. <laughs> there's some vibe that, that I wouldn't say I want to create. I wouldn't even think like that. But let's just say there's a vibe between us right now. I don't think, like, how do I want to maintain this vibe? I don't think what is the vibe. I, I just feel it. Hmm. And this takes like I don't think anyone can feel it if they're always scrolling on their phone if they're always like in their yeah. head it oh. takes stillness it takes fucking meditation it takes to be still with yourself to be open enough and e and available e enough to and spacious enough to feel that in the conversation and then speaking in a way that still feels true to that it's it's hard to explain it 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 comes with still it comes with it comes with stillness though like no one would ever fucking get it if they're always in their head scrolling yeah. if they don't take up meditate if, if if they don't have stillness in their life if they don't 
if they can't be in a in if they're not in an interaction where they feel like they have space like you have to have space in order to feel that and it's just a quick side note that's what's changed my my life about sex too like sex used, used to be something that was so un in un un enjoyable for me it was never fun because i was always thinking and i i wasn't i didn't have enough space i was always so stressed about making the other girl feel good that i didn't have enough space to like feel into how i want to express and what is in between us right now and how i want to express feeling into what would magnify this right now what would magnify this moment so basically what i would say is like creating that stillness within and finding your own and finding and feeling your own and your own energy and then being in a conversation with somebody and feeling like this this ten this ten this tension or this vibe that you feel with somebody and then making that the fucking priority over everything to grow and to build the, that's the priority over fucking saying every word fluent. That's the priori- priority over eye over eye contact. That's the priority over everything is how would I have to express myself? And this isn't a thinking, this is a feeling. It's just like, how would I express myself if I, if I were to maintain this vibe or to grow this vibe? It's hard. It's it's almost like you can't put it into words. But if, <laughs> but if, if I were to put it into words, that's what it would sound like. Cut off distraction then. And, and, uh, and open up. Yeah. I think. Create space. Yeah. O- open up. It means also that you are I- cr- creating space too because you are opening up. Yeah. Like I feel in something in between us right now. I do too. You do? And I, I, I feel something. And that's what I would say is a vibe. And all I care about like imagine if I just like go in my head and like say this word fluently that fucking fucking crushes this <laughs> shit it crushes it but if I were to well, main, main, yeah. maintain it by saying I don't fucking care if I stutter or not like this feeling right now is what we're after and I can maintain this and I can grow this just by fucking continuing to be open enough and not giving a fuck enough to put this as the pri as the priority and that when when that's the goal not like a thinking goal but a feeling goal your speech changes with that your the the way you say words the way you stutter changes with that because you're feeling into that and it kind of guides you in that way it sounds very <coughs> spiritual but um it is because when you actually was speaking here i forgot all about stuttering it was like, what are you t- t- talking about? It was like, I didn't even have a thought about the stuttering. Oh my God, I need to speak. I need to blah, blah. It was just like connection. Mm. Yeah. The vibe. 100%. Yeah. Uh, I felt it. Uh, and when you mentioned about about this, I remembered few instances from from my workplace and when I was in the Netherlands where I would tell a joke uh, and then the people people just didn't understand the joke and they were like uh, they felt like uh, I was trying to insult them yeah. Mm, yeah And I heard that maybe three or four times. Me actually. too. Yeah. Yeah. I feel. And, and now I understand why, why it happens. It makes more sense. Yeah. The the most recent thing I've done was of of this where it came where where it, where it came off wrong was there was this. <coughs> oh, I'm probably gonna see this actually. There's this girl, um, at a cafe that I go to. Um, she's quite cute and 
this was the first day that I met her. We were talking, we talked for quite a bit, and then she sat near the she sat near the she sat near the exit. Um, she 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 worked there, but she was just on her break. And as I was wa- and as I was and as I was walking out, I was like, "Hey, are you?" Here we go. I was like, "Hey, are you wait? Hey, are you waiting for me?" And she's like, "Waiting for you." And it's the the reason why she why she didn't get it as like a joke is because as soon as I went to say it, I caught myself being like, "Oh, I'm gonna stutter," and then I got serious about trying not to stutter. Yeah. And then it and then then it came out wrong. It was like, "Hey, Uh. it it came out wrong." I was like, "Hey, are you waiting for me?" I was like, "Oh no, I didn't mean to say it like that," but then I was like, "No, I'm just joking," and then it it was fine and stuff but like that vibe that that change i could have still said it in that play in that playful way with a stutter yes but because i tried not to like there wasn't a it, it wasn't a conscious thought of don't stutter but it was a e a e an e an emotional thing where i prioritized sounding smooth sounding fluent over maintaining this playful vibe it came out fucking weird. Even though it's fluent, yeah. even, even though it's fluent, it was just fucking. It came out weird. Yeah, my uh, I- 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 Italian colleague said to me also v- when I was doing my internship. He said to me that come on, stop being serious or like. You 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 are always so serious, Leo. I remember you saying that. I I remember that coming up on the call sometime. In the end of the, this all, um, I want to say a thing, and it's that I think maybe some people would think I'm talking bullshit right now, but I'm not. In the end, I'm actually very grateful for my stutter Mm. because it has made me the person I am. It sounds like a cliche, I know. You're so you're so cliche. But it's but it's it's like it's like it has made me to like uh, evolve and open books from book to book to find stuff uh, to cure this but instead of finding stuff to cure this because it's nothing to kick as well it's it's nothing to k- to cure in that way I've found stuff that th- that have that have made me like like uh, r- r- really um, r- r- really ha- uh, really happy you, you, you know I stutter now I know but it's m- I wait I, I wouldn't even say you stutter now I would say you didn't give yourself any fucking time there. I didn't give myself time you, you gave yourself you, you know you why yourself because this, am- this amount yes, of air I know to say well, yes I know because I think like we need to end this soon. You told me this <laughs> session is going to end. It's in my head like yeah. n- 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 hugging me. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So it's true. I'm going to take my time. Time, time, yeah. time. So in the end, everything I've looked for to, c- to, c- to cure this, I've come to a pl- <laughs> place now where I where i where i feel um inner inner joy you you know i am like (laughs) i am happy every day in the end Mm. every day every day i am happy at least in a time but every Mm. day Mm. i find a time where I am, ha- where I am happy, indeed. Mm. Yeah. And the person maybe who speaks like <laughs> very good m- might not have it. Yeah. At least I have this, and if I need to st- 
stutter like this to be as happy as I am, I would have it th 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 this way. Mm. Yeah. I, uh, if you can understand. I didn't understand a thing you said. You didn't? No, I'm just joking. Fuck. Um, I need to take a sip. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I truly think that um, stuttering can be the greatest thing for becoming yourself. Like it shows you, it shows you when you're not. And there's nothing in this world that is so fucking obvious that comes out so yes. obviously as a stutter. When <laughs> to everybody. To everybody when you're not being yourself. So it's either you gotta learn to fucking stutter your head off in every sentence and on, on every word, or you learn to be yourself. Like it gives you that and feels unfair to be put up with that face like why why can't i just be like everyone else and hide away and just be fluent but not be not be myself it kind of forces you to be yourself but i yes. i think that's what we need that's what a lot of people need is that force so i agree do you have last words leo i just think that it takes a lot of time to to to, to become yourself like uh, because you need to be so many things from Tony. Oh, dude, it takes forever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it takes forever. And, uh, I don't uh, think we never done. Yeah. But that, I just found it, I just find that it's a never ending, never ending thing to do. Well, no, no I, story. I agree with you 100%. No ending story. But th that's what m makes it fun also, because we, we know that we have something to do but some other people have no clue what to do. Yeah. Yes. 100%. And because of this, we are here. Yeah. Look at that. Like. Uh, and because of this, I have traveled to six countries this summer. First oh, stuttering. Almost me too. Yes. <laughs> nice. For stuttering and for internship and. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Yeah. And yeah, be it's because of this that I have been traveling the past three years too because of helping people who stutter maybe i'm gonna sit like this for a while so. anyway <laughs> thank you guys for tuning in i forget what episode maybe seven maybe eight um it's a long one mostly because of her <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna make another one <laughs> yeah <laughs> this this is just part one just joking um just joking about everything i said but anyway i hope i hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys in the next episode. Peace. Peace. Nice guys and gals. Whoa! I, I feel so I, tired. I